Hi guys, we're Courts and Meeks and welcome back to the channel. This week we've got another three minute van tour for you. Yes, but this one is going to be a little bit different because we're going across the waters to transport you to some friends. We're currently in mainland Greece down on the Peloponnese and they are in Croatia. So we hope you love them. They are the most funny couple we watch on YouTube. We absolutely love them. Philly and Keely from Chapter by Chapter. And they're going to give you a three minute tour of their van in one take. Hello and welcome to sunny Croatia. As you can see, for some reason, we've decided to do this in an abandoned industrial estate in the middle of nowhere. On the coldest day of the year in Croatia. <laughs> we are Philly and Keely, and this is our beautiful home on wheels, Martha. It is a 2011 Citroen Relay, and it's got just over 140,000 miles on the clock. So we've lived in there for almost two years now. The first year, we lived full time on the streets of London, mm -hmm. because that's where we worked. And then for six months, we were just riding out lockdown like everybody else back in Northern Ireland. And then for the last five months, we have been traveling across Europe. We left Northern Ireland at the start of June and we made our way down to Spain and now all the way across to Croatia out of the Xinjing zone. Xinjing? <laughs> Schengen? That's where we are now, but with the hopes of heading further east soon. But let's get stuck into this van tour. Yeah, let's do it. Are you ready? Uh, <laughs> I'll get ready. Come on. I'll get the stopwatch. <laughs> Three minute timer starts now. Okay, so we have this lovely window that we installed after the first year of living in it with no windows like hermits. And it slides open as you can see. Wow. Then moving along, we have got this lovely bench that ties in with the rest of our van. We only just built this like last week and we absolutely love it. Loads of storage tucked in there. We also have blackout blinds in the window, but I'll show you them when we're fully inside. So onto the kitchen, we have a beautiful solid oak countertop, which is a nightmare, but we love it anyway. We have got a little sink with a pull-out faucet. What, oops, I near spread that everywhere. <laughs> a double gas hob burner. We've got little hanger reels to hang stuff off, our lovely coffee pot. We've got a drawer for utensils, for spur utensils. Fridge, freezer, combi, Domatech CRX50. This is the basket that we keep all our fruit and vegetables in because when we kept it in the cupboard, they kept going off. So we had to put it on display. We keep our toiletries and stuff in this basket. Above the cab, we have got baking stuff, extra wires, pots and pans, vitamins, all that type of stuff tucked up there. Come further in. Coming in. Okay. <sighs> We have spice rack, etc., beans, tins, etc., all down there. Uh, plates, cups, cutlery, everything, food, all stored up here. A bookshelf, you know, whatever. Um, this is a little like living wall, even though it's not all living, just some of this is living. But we only just installed this again like last week, so we love it, it looks beautiful. In here we have got more storage, it's really unorganized, so let's not look at that. Underneath the sleeping seating area. So we've got two seats, we sit here, we eat our breakfast, lunch, dinner, we both work on our laptops here, etc. In here is more storage, like our Omnia Sweden, Hoover, like flask whatever okay now this little flask. yeah <laughs> this little step i need to get up in bed because uh, i'm short so i needed to get myself up okay up into the bedroom Ooh. we have got a double mattress memory foam we sleep wide ways because i don't know and <laughs> here we have got all our clothes stored bye bye for both of our cars <laughs> this is me this is billy <laughs> why is this so stressful <laughs> Then we've got this nice little magnetic board. We set our coffees here. We've got pine, pine cladded roof, pine cladded back doors, literally only painted yesterday. Um, lovely little ivy fairy lights. We've got two fans in the roof window here, a fan over there. Underneath this bed, if you want. I'm not gonna do it now, because I'll probably spill everything. We can lift this up on a hinge to get to the storage underneath. We did a full storage tour recently. I'll link the video. What else am I meant to say? Uh, batteries and solar panels. Oh yeah, so here you can see we've got our inverter, we've got our solar controller, all our switches that we can reach from red, our diesel heater, which is underneath the cab. We have got three batteries, 120 amp hours each, three solar panels on the roof, 320 watts solar, 360 amp Whoa. hours. <laughs> <laughs> three minutes, how do I stop this? Okay. <laughs> Stop it! <laughs> Freaking Emma! Wow, I'm I'm stressed for you. <laughs> that was nuts. Oh, uh, I'm actually stressed. I think you did such a banger job, though. You missed our uh, bin come seat. Yeah, and the fingerboard and our hanging plants, but you know, 
They can be in the, the next three minute tour. Friggin' air man. That was that was tough. High five. <laughs> Pressure on. Well done. <laughs> I'm so proud of you. You can get back in now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Wow. That was one tech. Like, we didn't rehearse that. I'm impressed. I'm impressed that too. That was quite like, <laughs> that's the longest and shortest three minutes of my life. <laughs> well. <laughs> so thanks so much Quartz and Meeks for challenging us to do that. That was pretty stressful. No, it was so much fun. It was easy for me. I just had to follow you around with the camera. <laughs> if you enjoyed this video, make sure to subscribe. It really helps us out. And hopefully we'll see you guys on the next one. Yeah, thanks again. Bye. Bye. <laughs> I'll start outside, I'll start outside, get myself hyped. Hyped!